Addressing the press in Muranga County, the residents led by Lucas Njoroge say the involvement of MCAs and other political leaders in the recruitment of 20,000 NHIF cover beneficiaries out of a population of over 1 million people politicized the entire process because politicians have instead of registering genuine vulnerable people, they have registered their loyalists, girlfriends and close family members. A project that has been dubbed Kangatakia. This is the project that we want to say that we have witnessed the highest levels of discrimination ever witnessed before in Muranga. Because we want to know the process that was used to recruit those who have been registered to be the members of this project. And we know and we have the information that those people who have been recruited were taken by the MCAs and other leaders of the county to the county to, the, to, 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 to be enrolled in this project. But we have information that those who are taken were the friends of MCAs, they are agents and they are political affiliates, everyone who campaigned for them. Those are the people who have been recruited and submitted that they should benefit from this project. They say that it has left behind those suffering and with chronic diseases at the masses of their own since most of the funds will be channeled to those who least need the funds. Lamenting the recruitment process, the residents say they have filed a petition in Muranga High Court and a certificate of urgency for the entire program to be quashed on the basis of not following the law on its establishment. Most of the people who have been enrolled or recruited as beneficiaries of that program are uh, people who are very close to the, govern to the governor and the MCAs. So we are saying we, are, we want to put a stop to this program before our people. We have a lot of people who are sick and we want them to be, uh, to be enrolled and, and benefit from the same program. Any government project must start the first step is public participation. In the case of the Kangata care, we have not witnessed anything to do with the public participation. They sent a sinister motive on the Kangata government because only less public hospitals in Muranga County accommodate NHIF covered patients, thus leaving the private health facilities with the advantage. We want it to be relaunched and people to be called to put their to air their concerns and opinions. And, and after that, it must, be, it must be approved by the people of Moranga. That is not the case here in Moranga. Because the moment we give some people insurance and we don't insure the others, we are saying that we have left us some people. On naming program Kangata Care, the resident says this amounts to personalization of government programs, which goes against the 2010 constitution. When you we talk about the NHIF, we are talking about a national program. So, uh, according to the Kangata Kia, the public hospitals, where most of our people go when they are sick, uh, uh, is not, is not uh, actually uh, taken into consideration. Because the whole focus, the, whole, the, the sole focus, or the entire focus of this program is to, towards the private hospitals and private entities. So there is a scheme that there is some fishy business that is being done in this guise of helping our people. Although the program is good if implemented after public participation, the youth residents are of the view that the county government should first concentrate in equipping Muranga public hospitals with the state-of-the-art medical apparatus. The issue to do with public health is a critical issue, is a matter of importance. It should not be taken lightly like the way it has been taken in the, in the county of Moranga. So we want it to be repeated. We want people to actually participate. And we want to see transparency. We want to see justice. And we want to see our people of Moranga benefit from that such a good program. We want to remind our governor that under the new constitution, it is against the constitution to personalize programs. And that is why we had holidays that were called Moide and Kenyatta Day. And they were renamed to other names like Mashujade. And that is what we are saying. You do not have necessarily to name a program after your name by calling it Kangata Kia. There are better names that you can call it. You can even call it Muranga Kia. 
because you are using government money and one day you will be out of that office and it will be occupied by someone else and that person will not carry on with your name because he will have a totally different name from yours and probably he will be your competitor so you, you, you have to take things very seriously because that is abuse of office by personalizing program. One of the Kenya Kwanzaa government flagship agenda is universal health coverage. The residents have urged President William Ruto to intervene and make Kangata care universal to all Muranga residents, but not to a handful 20,000 cherry picked by politicians. For Ebru TV, Amode Francis.